Hi and Assalamu alaikum. Welcome back once again to Technology Information Channel. Today in this video we are going to talk about red exhaust manifold. May we face with this problem, how to fix it, step by step troubleshooting guide in this video. Before starting the video, a small request to all newcomers, if you are first time on my channel, please make sure to subscribe my channel and hit the bell notification to getting more latest update videos. I take a few pictures to understand giving examples and how to check step by step to fix this issue. Okay. So let's get started. Watch the video complete from A to Z to understand. And if you have this problem, please follow the steps. So let's get started. First of all, the first step is check your turbocharger. Make sure your turbocharger has no any leakage okay and clean and working condition when the turbocharger is leaked too much and excess your oil is going to the exhaust line okay as you can see first of all the oil is pushes to the exhaust manifold and then going to the exhaust line and then to the muffler okay what will happen as you can see this is this is the complete block diagram of the turbocharger as you can see here we have the red side this is our exhaust side and the blue side is our intake side okay when the red side exhaust turbocharger have two turbine one is suck air and one is push the exhaust gases to out okay when the exhaust uh, side turbo side is leaked this is pushes too much oil to the exhaust line okay oil is leaking from the turbo and this oil push to the exhaust line okay and also the oil is flammable when the engine is running on on load this remain and push oil in a, inside the exhaust manifold catch a fire okay when this take the catch a fire the exhaust goes to red and hot this is the sign of the leak turbocharger understand so move to the step 2 to confirm if the inlet side is leaked of the turbocharger the engine uh, suck too much uh, oil inside the combustor chamber and then burns with the combustion and this make a blue blue smoke okay this is the sign of the intake side leak understand so let's move to the step number two as you can see here we have the engine timing if the engine have the timing issue or retarded the fuel injection system the fuel injection system is disturbed due to the retarded fuel injection okay in this scenario when the, uh, the, uh, the injector spray the fuel inside the combustion chamber that's lately combust okay when that's lately combust the some remaining fuel going to the exhaust line not properly burning this fuel okay when too much fuel is going to the exhaust line let's take catch a fire and make the exhaust red hot this is the step number two problem after the confirmation of the engine timing now we have to move to the step number three okay step number three is the verification of your fuel injectors okay remove your all injectors and go to the laboratory and check all injectors okay as you can see here the injector four states states number one is means leak injector states number two is list spray okay states number three is sides spray state number four is good spray okay check your and verify your fuel injector make sure no have any stock open injector or faulty injectors okay when your injector or stock open or leak that's the fuel in a combustion chamber is going uh, exists your amount of fuel inside the combustion chamber and also the fuel uh, uh, combustion chamber have a, a com uh, air fuel ratio 
most of engine have 14.1 combustion ratio okay when the excessive fuel is going to the combustion all fuel not burning properly and some remaining fuel from the combustion is going to the exhaust line and make the exhaust red and hot step number four is air cleaner filter make sure you have a good condition air cleaner filter check your and inspect your air cleaner filter not be clogged or too dirty okay when your air cleaner filter is too dirty this the engine is not getting a uh, fresh oxygen in good condition and full amount of oxygen for the combustion and that's uh, causes of the, the fuel not properly burning causes of the lack of oxygen and some remaining and unburned fuel is going to the exhaust line and then take again catch a fire inside the exhaust and that's making the exhaust red and hot okay make sure your uh, air cleaner filter is cleaned and not too dirty and working condition so let's move to the last and final part make sure you have a clean and fresh radiator if you have a radiator too dirty or clogged that's the, the cooling system of your engine is not properly working causes of dirty radiator your engine cooling system is disturbed and it's not working to cool down your engine okay in this condition your cooling system is properly disturbed your cooling circulation in all is disturbed the engine temperature is not to cool down and the engine getting exists your temperature causes of clog or dirty radiator and this case your exhaust pipe is be the red hot as you can see this is the clear sign of the some steps check the all step and verify thanks for watching see you all next time goodbye